Burnley have been bad this season. And just to give you an idea of how bad they've been, they're having their worst season in the last five, which is absolutely shocking. And I mainly put this down to bad defending. They've shipped a lot of goals this season and haven't really scored many. I also think that Tarkowski's injury has also been a factor. He missed quite a few games at the start of the season and as a result, the team had a slow start. He's that important. But regardless of that, Burnley have looked better in recent weeks and it looks like they'll be climbing up the league table very soon. Looking at their results this season, obviously the May United game has been rescheduled. May United came back late from the Europa League, so that game is going to be played at a later date. Uh, Burnley also shipped four against Leicester. They shipped three against Chelsea. They shipped three against Newcastle. And they also shipped five recently against City. So not great those results, but you could argue those teams are top quality opposition. Although the Newcastle team, you could argue they're not top quality, but anyway, regardless of that, they haven't really done that badly this season. Obviously, some of the games they should have won, like maybe losing home to Southampton, and even the Tottenham game, I think they were very, very unlucky to lose that, but, you know, that's what happens in the Premier League. And even more recently, the one more result against Everton wasn't too bad. So, maybe in the next couple of weeks, we'll really see Burnley pick up a lot of points, but we'll have to wait and see. In the upcoming fixtures, they've got Arsenal up next, which is a massive game. Because Arsenal haven't been playing that well this season, they've actually been pretty poor as well. So if Burnley can, you know, get something out of their game, or even a win, that'll be massive for them. Then after that, they go to Villa, which will be a tough game. Villa are in good form this season, so I don't really see them getting anything out of that. Then they've got Wolves at home, who... Wolves have been a strange team this season. They've been good defensively for most games, but we see games like Liverpool and West Ham, where they just ship a lot of goals. So I'm not really too sure where they're at, but that'll be an interesting game. Then there's Leeds away, which will be tough. Leeds, you know, there was a period of time a couple of weeks ago where they were shipping a lot of goals, but they tightened up and they'll look kind of decent again. And then Sheffield at home is an absolute must win. They cannot lose that game or even draw it. That has to be a win. So we're looking at this. There's a lot of winnable games coming up. And if Burnley can pick up, you know, five games, that's 15 points. If they can pick up, you know, maybe you know, seven to nine points out of these games, that'll be very, very good. And I can easily see them doing it. So, you know, maybe they can arrest, you know, rectify this bad start and, you know, maybe have a decent season. But we'll have to wait and see. And that's about it.